everyone, May Fake 1210 here, and today I have the 75295 Millennium Falcon Microfighter. This is, of course, the third Millennium Falcon Microfighter. It's from 2021, has 101 pieces, and retails for $10. Without further ado, let's get into it. Our one and only minifigure in this set is, of course, Han Solo. This is based off his Episode 4 appearance, and actually comes in the Most Icy Cantina Master Builder series. He does have a little blaster pistol there, and, of course, he does have an alternate face on the back of his head. Anyways, for the set itself, as a new person to microfighters, I think this is actually pretty decent. First off, I think the engines look really good. They were able to capture that design, and that's just using some hinge pieces like so. There's some nice turquoise on the inside of there, which does add a little extra blue to the engines in the little cracks and crevices, so that is pretty nice. Do have the cockpit area over here with the seat for Han Solo. I do wish they put a little radar dish there to actually finish off the little view screen there instead of just leaving it at that. But it does look rather nice with that print anyways. And just to show you what Han looks like in the Millennium Falcon, it's pretty easily attaches to the two studs there, and he's pretty huge compared to the rest of it. Anyways, the docking port on this side, this entire side here, this uh, right side when viewed from the front, looks really good. I really like it. You got the uh, radar dish there, and you do, of course, have a stud shooter, which they just fire off. Like so, pretty standard nowadays. They've been in sets since like 2014. And yeah, then the underside does have some of these reversed uh, tiles there, so that way you can set it on a surface and not worry about scratching or getting caught on anything. So yeah, overall, pretty good. And then quick looking at the box, you do have the Series 8 there. There is a TIE Fighter in the corner, and for the canceled uh, Micro Fighter set, I'm thinking it was going to be a TIE Fighter just given with the box art, but we may never know. Anyways, there's the back, and of course there is the newer uh, Micro Fighter dual pack. The back of the instructions are like all the other ones, Skywalker Saga, all the minifigures, and of course all the sets. I currently have reviews out for Luke's X-Wing, this set of course, and the Trouble on Tatooine set. So that's my review for this set, and as a first time experience with Microfarris, I definitely think anybody who hasn't should look into them. Honestly, I th at first thought they were really gimmicky and looked kind of dumb, but after having one in hand, I kind of appreciate how this is sort of a small little desk model. It has one or two play features in it, and honestly, looks like the actual thing. It's got a cartoony feel to it that I kind of like, and I can see why this is so appealing to a lot of people, and now including me. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave your thoughts on this in the comment section down below. Be sure to subscribe if you have not. Hope you're all having a happy new year, and I will see you all in the next video. Till next time, guys. Goodbye.